In the annals of the digital agora, the clash between rapper Blueface and Soldier Boy reverberated like a cacophony of clashing swords, a spectacle that left the virtual Colosseum ablaze with the fiery exchange of insults and controversial proclamations. Hey, so check it out. I already right? beat you hey, to the check punch. It out, check it out. Check it out. Right. Go ahead. Just wanna hop on here and pop it, right? Yeah. Why did you talk about old oh, shit? What's old about your BM sucking my dick? What did you? What did you? Why did you talking about before she even met Nigga, you? Nigga, I asked right? your baby mama the day before your baby shower. Nigga. Why is you on here? So you on here popping it like that? So, so, Why didn't so, fuck hey, your hey, DM so, today before so, your baby so check shower? This out, check this out. So check so, this out, right? Good, okay. What you want, money? You want a cookie? You want a no. cookie? No. You want a cookie? You Let's give Blue Face a cookie and a meal and a soldier it's toy. Blood. Yeah. You a bitch. So what, blood? Hey, there you go. Admit that. No, I'm saying. Admit so you that fuck, shit. So, so, so you Admit fuck that shit. So you fucked the bitch. Your, so, I fucked your so, bitch so, out. So, so, so what's up? So I quit, nigga. Oh, nigga, you don't want to get down, though, nigga. You don't want to get out. I had just giving it up. Why? What about so though? And why you crying you about? See, you why never, you crying you about Offset just bitch. fucking your you never bitch? Touch my why you crying about Offset just a bitch? You wanna know why I did that? Why you do that? Cause the bitch get on here popping it, making up lies. I'm gay. I'm this. I'm trying to do this. Okay, you wanna pop it? So I know that's that's police. How? So, How so you, put so, you snitch, so you snitching now? So you a snitch now? I thought you could only snitch to the pop to the cops. Soldier. So you okay? So you just hop. So you just hop out. You just say. I you thought say, you could only snitch to the police. Soldier. So so long as they call the police, you, 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 you just you just run around telling niggas business. That's what you do, huh? Blue nah, Blue. I'm running around. Anybody wanna wanna join the blue face circus? They they're indulging in my business. You sound. We're like gonna use fuck. you, soldier. You sound... We're gonna use you. Offset wanted to be used. Offset, you wanna talk? Using you, nigga. Use a buster, nigga. What fuck you talking about, Listen, you want to talk about Offset, right? Listen. Yeah, all, yeah, all that came out, and guess what? Offset got mad about his wife. He made some threats, and we had somebody go tap his shoulder in Miami a couple days ago and let him know he's touchable, and he won't make hey, another threat yo, again. Nigga. I'm hey, really like that. that. Hey, what that got to do? Hey, what that got to do with You brought it up. What that got to do? What that got to do with me, my nigga? You the Instagram live battleground became a theater of verbal warfare with the combatants like modern-day gladiators, hurling barbed words at each other. As Blueface, with the audacity of a Trojan hero, dead Solza boy to discuss his romantic escapades, the latter, reminiscent of the cunning Odysseus, cleverly shifted the focus to Blueface's ex-girlfriend, weaving a web of accusations as intricate as the thread spun by Anichni. The air thickened with tension, an atmosphere reminiscent of the political intrigues in the court of Machiavelli, where reputations were currency and power was the ultimate prize. Blueface, in retaliation, wielded the sword of personal vendetta, thrusting it into the heart of Solza Boy's familial ties by invoking his baby mama just before a celebration of new life. The exchange mirrored the melodrama of Shakespearean tragedy, where personal vendettas and familial betrayals unfolded with the inevitability of a Greek prophecy. The verbal jousting continued, with Solza Boy, the master of the digital amphitheater, deriding Blueface's thirst for attention. Blueface, in response, dismissed these taunts as the idle murmurs of a tempest, suggesting that Solza Boy's yearning for fame was akin to chasing shadows in the dark. The verbal crossfire, akin to the back and forth of Socratic dialectics, showcased the clash of egos and the pursuit of validation. As the verbal tempest gathered force, Soldier Boy, akin to a modern-day Igo, accused Blueface of disloyalty, planting seeds of doubt in the fertile soil of their shared past. Blueface, like a vigilant seeking justice, questioned Soldier Boy's integrity, throwing the weighty accusation of snitching a charge that resonates in the corridors of both criminal enterprises and ethical debates. The rap industry, akin to a tempestuous sea, now bears the ripples of their clash, with ramifications seeping into the very bedrock of cultural discourse. This clash of titans, reminiscent of the epic battles in Homeric poems, introduces a divisive element within the rap industry. 
The enmity between Blueface and Soldier Boy has the potential to create schisms reminiscent of the Peloponnesian War, dividing artists and fans into ideological camps. The once unified chorus of the rap community now echoes with dissonance, creating a discordant symphony that could influence collaborations, endorsements, and even the public's perception of these artists. Within the broader cultural landscape, the consequences of this digital duel are akin to seismic tremors shaking the foundations of societal norms. The rap industry, once celebrated for its unity and solidarity, now finds itself grappling with internal strife. The clash mirrors the polarized narratives that permeate contemporary culture, where individuals are compelled to choose sides in the digital coliseum. The rap genre, often hailed as a mirror reflecting the zeitgeist, now bears the scars of this clash. The cultural ramifications extend beyond the boundaries of the rap industry, affecting the perception of artists as cultural icons. The digital duel not only mars the reputations of Blueface and Soldier Boy, but also tarnishes the broader perception of the rap industry, painting a picture of discord and internal strife. The consequences of this clash delve deeper into the psyche of a society that often looks to cultural figures for inspiration and guidance. The once unifying force of music is now overshadowed by the divisive narrative spawned in the digital arena. It echoes the historical battles where ideological differences led to cultural schisms, such as the reformation that cleaved through the heart of medieval Europe. As the digital duel unfolds, it becomes apparent that the consequences are not confined to the rap industry alone. They resonate with broader cultural shifts, where the lines between personal feuds and public discourse blur. The clash becomes a microcosm of societal tensions, reflecting the contemporary penchant for polarization and the erosion of a shared cultural narrative. The plot thickened as Soldier Boy, like a Machiavellian puppet master, introduced the character of Offset into the unfolding drama. Soldier Boy's claim of orchestrating a confrontation with Offset in Miami cast him as a puppeteer pulling the strings of intimidation and influence. The revelation, reminiscent of Cold War espionage, suggested a clandestine power dynamic within the rap reel. In the grand tapestry of this Instagram live saga, the clash between Blueface and Soldier Boy unfolded as a modern-day epic, complete with verbal duels, familial betrayals, and the wielding of digital power. The echoes of historical intrigues, from the political machinations of Machiavelli to the familial sagas of Shakespeare, resonated through the virtual Colosseum. As the dust settled in the aftermath of this digital duel, one couldn't help but reflect on the timeless truth that in the realm of fame and influence, alliances are fragile, reputations are malleable, and the pursuit of dominance often leads down the treacherous path of enmity.